my big thing is operationalization. I think that you are going to see over the next 12 months, many organizations begin to get um, bounded high value use cases into production. I think there's going to be a realization um, by companies that they can deliver value using uh, using uh, AI technology um, that they can deploy into production within short timeframes, within kind of like anywhere between 30 and 90 days. Um, and if you prioritize well, you can, you can do that. I think there's going to be a couple of things that you're going to see. Um, workflow cognification uh, is going to be one. You're, you, you, a lot of organizations kind of start on the generative type of use cases. That's kind of chatbots and uh, knowledge agents and those types of things. Um, but they're actually the hardest ones to get uh, to uh, to deploy and get to the level of accuracy that you need. It's not that you can't, but they're they're difficult. Um, the ones that you're going to see is more on discriminative use cases, I believe, where workflows, documents moving through organizations, uh, and using vision technologies in order to in order to help you process those uh, uh, much much quicker. I mean, to a I'll give you an example. We did one recently. Took the uh, workflow from five months to five minutes to give you a, a perspective on, on on what can be done here. So I think workflow cognification is definitely going to be one. I think you're going to see the beginning of the move away from um, from configured SaaS solutions uh, to custom SaaS solutions. So configured SaaS that you rent. Um, which over the last number of decades, we've seen an integration of um, tasks and utilities. Um, I actually think you're going to see the beginning of disintegration where you're going to get specific um, uh, utilities that are enabled by generative AI that are going to deliver value that you don't have to pay rent for anymore. You're just going to build them. You're going to own them. Um, I think that also you're going to see you're going to see individuals within organizations that are going to get beyond the embarrassment, uh, if you like, where people are kind of maybe a little bit using a generative AI serendipi like like behind the scenes a little bit and not pretending that they're using it uh, because they're a little bit embarrassed about it um, for no reason. Um, and I think you're going to see or uh, individuals within organizations realizing that trope that you know it's. Uh, AI is going to take your job, but people using AI are going to take your job, and that—that that is, uh, it, it is, it is a truth. Um, so I would back what Mary Rose is saying. I think that the biggest risk that organizations have uh, facing them right now is complacency. Um, the the technology is real. The hype is deserved. Um, there are mistakes that can be made. There are things that you need to be aware of. They are solved problems. Um, uh, so yeah, avoid complacency. The risk isn't in the generative AI. The risk is in the is not doing anything. So operationalization is my one big thing.